Well, we're about ready to kick off. The Aggies will be kicking back toward the uh, north. The return men are McNeil and Ogletree. And it's going to go into the end zone. And matter of fact, McNeil will not be able to make a play on that. It'll go over his shoulder. Quarterback is Lancaster. And they come out and they show a shotgun halfback to his right. First down and 10. ULM at their 20. They'll pass out into the flats to the left side behind the 20. Now across the 20 to the 25-26 yard line. Give you the particulars on Lancaster after this play. It's second down five at the 25 yard line. There's the snap in a shotgun and Lancaster is handed off to the halfback coming to the right side across the 30 to the 33. That's the uh, read option and a good job by Chris Harrington of chasing that one down from behind but still enough yards eight yard gain to pick up the first down at the 33. Kinsman Lancaster is their quarterback. He's 5'11", 202, a junior play action. Drops back to the 25 looking long to the left side. Got a man down there and it is incomplete at the 30 and perhaps out of bounds. That was Greg Sapp, the intended receiver. Marquise Carpenter there defensively. Aggie D has limited their opponents to 119 rushing, 282 passing, and total offense of 401 after the first game. Here, after the first two games, here's a handoff. They get back to the line of scrimmage, a yard to the 34. That's Dawson again. Here is a third down from about the 34 and a half yard line. Shotgun empty in the backfield. Four wides to the left here on this play on third down. There's the snap. Drops back. Sets up. Steps up. Now he's thinking about running. Will not. Throws off the intended receiver's hands. The man was string fellow. They got a first down, but they stall out then, not being able to convert the third to a first. So it's fourth down. They'll end up needing about eight. They'll stand back. The punter again is Love. He'll stand right at the 21-yard line. Peterson now has moved up to the 25. Into the ball game tonight. We'll check him here in a moment. And a flag has gone down. An illegal procedure apparently. Ball start, number 50 of the offense. Penalty is five yards, and it's still fourth down. And line of scrimmage now, the 24 and a half after the five-yard markoff. Love will take the snap at the 16, kicks away. It's a better kick this time. Backing up at the 33, starts his return. Got by one man now, tackled across the 40 to the 43-yard line. So here go the Aggies, their first possession. Stephen McGee opening up at quarterback. And he's in a shotgun with a running back, Dvorsky Lane to his left. Wants to throw on first down, he does, and he throws high and tended on that far sideline to Urban Taylor. Way over his head, incomplete. Empty in the backfield, shotgun formation, three wides right, one of them Lane. Now Lane's coming in motion back to the left of McGee. And we have a flag down at the line of scrimmage, a legal procedure against Texas A&M. Well, back start. us up five. Number 71 of the offense. Penalty is five yards, and it's still second down. So now second down, 15, the Aggies, no score, 13-17 to go. First period, first touch of the night for a &M. Drops back to throw out of a shotgun. He does. It's caught across the 40 at the 45, and now out of bounds. Pierre Brown caught that one. All right, the Aggies now into the uh, ball game tonight on their third downs. We'll show here, and I'll look at that in just a moment as we get an opportunity. As they throw now a pump and now a throw and that's the catch and that's Taylor. That's a first down at the 40 yard line across midfield. Taylor just caught it a little bit over his left shoulder on a bullet thrown by McGee down to the 40. That's a first down the Aggies. That goes 13 yards. Aggies 53% on their thirds in their first two games. First down 10 at the ULM handed off to Goodson now at their 40. He's bottled up, bounces out of there now, got away from some pursuit for the 40. He is hit and goes down at the 35. Second down five at the 35, moving the ball in Warhawk territory. Shotgun, Jaborski Lane play action. McGee drops back. He's going toward the end zone, turning around, and it is way out of bounds. That ball is intended for Kerry Franks. It goes incomplete. Aggies now have run a total of uh, six plays, and they will go to the air five times. Here's third down for AM. One out of one, early go here. Under center is McGee. Starts the option. Looking for the pitch. Here it goes. Goodson caught it. They're closing on him. They had him for a moment. He got the first down. Wow. Oh, they had him bottled up, pinned against the sideline. He got away from a man, wherefore Josh Thompson finally forced him out. Where do they? 
Well, I think they're going to oh, say stepped out. Yeah, Boy, it looked like he was way past the 31-yard line. Didn't get the first down. Stepped out at the 31. That will yes, be the call. Is. Nick wearing that number 12. We have him on the radio show on Thursday night. There's the handoff. It goes to Lane. He has the first down and about five more. Lane had carried 33 times, 161 yards in the first two games combined. First down, 10. The ball at the 25 and a half. Single setback. Goodson. The Ags run the option. Here is McGee turning the corner. He's got the first down across the 15 to the 13-yard line. One carry, 12 yards, McGee, shotgun, running backs either side of him, waiting on the snap from Wallace, and he's got it, and he just had play action to Javorski Lane. He'll fight for the 11. They wrap him up around the waist. Line of scrimmage again, about the 13 and a half, and they gets it to the 11-yard line. Here's second down and about eight. Ball at about the 11. They gave it to uh, Javorski. Someone caught him around the ankles. That saved the touchdown, brought him down at the five-yard line. It was Travis Eichmann. One out of two on their thirds, one of one on their fourths. Joy Thomas goes in motion. There is Lane, and he is in the end zone. That's a touchdown from five out. The J train is in the station. Boy, there's nothing fancy about this. It's just straight ahead running. Good blocking by that offensive line, knocking the Warhawks off the ball. And Javorski just puts his head down and is not going to stop until he hits pay dirt. Five-yard touchdown run for Javorski gives the Ags the early lead. Now the extra point from Zamansky. It's up, and it is good. And the Aggies lead at 7-0, 9.36 to go here in the first quarter, and A&M's taking a 7-0 lead. Zamansky about ready to kick off. He teed it up at the 30. That's a new spot this year, and he's been good from the 30. Boy, he's got a great leg. They've got their men deployed at the goal line. His last kick went into the end zone. This one has a chance to be returned. Nope, they're going to say take a knee about a yard deep, and that's what they'll do. So they'll bring it out to the 20. They started their first possession at the 20 at ULM. Yes, they did, and I expect them to try to, th- to throw the ball uh, more tonight than they have in their first two games. Empty in the backfield, throws a screen to this side, caught at the 20, broke a tackle, leaps to the 25-yard line. 102 yards on his first two games, his average throwing the ball. He's in a shotgun running back to his left. There's the snap, and he is handed off to that man. That's Dawson again. He's got good yardage out across the 40. First down and 10. That will be the second of the game for the Warhawks. Shotgun again, running back to the right of Lancaster. Kinsman is his first name. Long snap count. There it is. And he's going to keep it after a fake into the line. Spins. Got a yard to the 43. First man missed him. Second man did not. Second down, nine. Ball on the 43. 8-12 to go. First period. Aggies lead. 7-0. Warhawks the ball. In a shotgun. Drops back. Screen again. It's caught at the 43. Out to the 50. Now to the 49. Ball caught by Daryl McNeil. Lancaster will move under center. Offset eye. Puts a tight end in motion right to left. They just hand it off. Dawson's got a hole, and he will get a first down to the Aggie 46-yard line. The gang tackle actually never goes down. Now he eventually does. Well, they were pushing him all over the place, and somebody lost a helmet. Herring, they were out there in the fan zone signing autographs prior to the game. Next fan zone will be prior to the Baylor game. The Aggies on the road Thursday night will be at the Orange Bowl in Miami. ULM, Ags lead 7-0. They've got the ball, the Warhawks 7-27. First period, first down and 10 at the Aggie 46. There's the snap. And uh, da- rather Lancaster will keep it. Didn't want to. Took it back. Dropped behind the line back at the 49-yard line. Back to the Aggie 49. They must get to the a and 36 for a first down. Empty in the backfield. The three wides right. Open sides to the right. Two on the left. He's going to look to the left. That ball is a catch. And it uh, was it complete or incom- incomplete? Incomplete. Third down, 13, ball at the Aggie 49. Shotgun, four wides to the right, one to the left. Drops back, looks to throw, will. It's a catch, it's a first down at the A&M 29-yard line. As a running back to his right, there's the snap. Dawson just got it, he's looking for the left side. Obazora has him and the two will go into the sideline. About a yard gain when they force him out at about the 26. Here's second down and a long eight. They need to get to the Aggie 18. Ball at about the 26 and a half. 
Going to throw. He's well. He's going to throw end zone. And that man fell down as he's trying to get to the ball. Bumped a little bit by Carpenter. ULM two of three on their thirds. The ball is at the Aggie 26 and a half. Again, they've got to get to the Aggie 18. Hashmark left side. Running back to his left. Two wides right. Got a split in over on the left side. The tight end is lined up on the right side. That's uh, Zeke Zachary. The double Z. Has the ball. There's the shovel pass. It goes to Dawson's. Got a first down and a lot more across the 15 to the 12. Shovel pass was wide open. Lancaster again and a shotgun. Line of scrimmage, the Aggie 11. They will keep it on the ground. Burst out to the left side across the 10 to the 6. Here's second down and about 5 at the Aggie 6 yard line. They just snapped the ball to the running back, McNeil. He carries close for a first down across the 5 to about the 1. They have revealed that it indeed is a first down, Dave, at the one yard line. They've got it first and goal, trying to tie it here with 4.45 to go in the first. 7 0 the Aggies. At the one, the Warhawks. Offset eye. They move a tight end right side, left side. Flanker now is coming back to this side, and that's Zachary. Goes on the ground. That's Dawson. He has a touchdown, and it was pretty easy. And now here is the extra points. It's down, it's up. And they say it's good. And so we're tied at seven with 4.31 to go. And they'll kick off from the 30. The Aggie return men standing around the five. Here's the kick. And it'll take it from the five-yard line. And the 20 break out of there across the 30 goes Kerry Franks to about the 32-yard line before he hit and goes down. Here's first down the Aggies at the 32-yard line after the kickoff return of about 28 yards by Franks. Pierre Brown goes in motion, slot left, tight end right in the shotgun. And they throw, and that's Franks. He caught it at the 39. He gets a first down as he advances the ball to the 43-yard line. Bags come out, show a shotgun, running backs either side of McGee, line of scrimmage, the 43, their side of the 50. Javorski Lane got it, got a yard to well, maybe a yard and a half, close to the 45 on a carry over the right side. Break the huddle, going wide right here is Terrence McCoy. McCoy has a reception of 17 yards. He is the split in in that direction. They've got a slot on the right side. And uh, on the ground, here's Goodson. Big hole, 45, 40, used a block, 30. Tight ropes it. They say he stepped out at the 26-yard line. First down and 10 at the ULM 26-yard line. Under center will go McGee. Javorski Lane lined up behind him, standing back at the 33. They give it to Lane. He tries right side, a little footwork there, and goes to the 25-yard line. It's second and nine. AM now is 13 of 13 on red zone scores. Second down at about nine. Shotgun again for McGee. Throws, screen. That is Taylor. Leaps high in the air to bring it down. Advances to the 22. Caught it at the line of scrimmage on a screen right. Aggies now have scored on their initial drive in all three of our games this year. Field goal against Montana State. Touchdown against Florida State. And a touchdown here tonight against ULM. Third down and about seven. McGee's under a lot of pressure. He's going to throw. It's a catch at the 20 down to the 19. Leaping high and bringing that one down for the Aggies, Pierre Brown. It looks like they're going to go for it here, Dave, on fourth and about uh, four. Michael Goodson will be the tailback. Two tight ends. Flankers left and right. The lone setback again is Goodson. McGee turns around, says something to him. The snap, start the option. McGee's going to turn the corner, has a first down, and he is waist tackled at the seven yard line. Out of bounds, they roll. Cardia Jackson around his waist, and the two roll out of bounds at the seven. The Aggies just converted their second fourth. Oh, flag down. Where? They're at about the 27. And replay fourth down. And Tom, this will be kicked from the 35-yard line, so it's a 45-yard effort. It's back to his left. Yeah, indeed. Angle to his left. Like you said, he's 4 of 6 this year, 6 of 11 career. He has a long of 43. Here's the snap, the hold, the kick. It's got the distance, and it made it. Nice kick. Just got inside the right upright. Big kick by Manzamansky. 56 seconds left to play in the first quarter, and the Aggies take the lead 10 to 7. Well, they had gone for it on fourth, Dave, and then the penalty. Oh, yeah, and they picked it up handily inside the 10-yard line on the option keep by McGee. But you don't walk away. Without points. Here's Zemanski kicking off. They've not been able to return his first two kickoffs. This one is backing up. Boy, he's put it right on the E in Texas. They'll take the knee out to the 20. It comes again. It's first down and 10, ULM at their 20. Ags lead 56 seconds to go in the first. 
10 to 7. Lancaster drops back, throws. That's a catch. It's coughed up. Was it a catch or not? No, incomplete. Tied in. Zachary went in motion. He just gave it to Dawson. Dawson's spurting out here to the 20. Flag down. They're going to get caught for a hit. Carpenter. Well, it's about the time man. they called the holding calls. They've Darryl been holding McNeil. all night. McNeil is the one who is uh, going to get caught on the hold. Now there's another flag here at the 30. Ball was carried by Dawson. He would have been close for a first down. Number three of the offense. Penalty is 10 yards, and it's still second down. All right, three flags caught that. All right, move it back to the 10. Second down and 20. 35 seconds to go in the first. The Aggies lead 10 to 7. Clock is moving. Shotgun for Lancaster. He's gone to the air five times, completed 10 for 53 and a long of 21. Move that man that was there to his right. Off to the right side. Here's a throw. It's a catch. That'll be a tied in. It's out to the 15-yard line. Ball caught by Mitch Doyle. Zags called a timeout. Six seconds to go in the first. AM leads 10 to 7. ULM now third down and 15 at their 15-yard line. Running back to the right of Lancaster. Draw. And it's a draw. They will try the middle, and they'll get about three or four yards, maybe the 19. Here's fourth down, and now the punt. Peterson's going to stand at the Aggie 46. Waiting on the snap. Has one return for 11. Pretty good kick at midfield. And it is not fair caught. Takes it at the 49 and dropped at the 49-yard line, and that will be the first period. McGee saying something to both sides of the line. And he has the snap, starts to run the option. Now he drops back. He's under some pressure. He is going to throw, and he's hit as he's releasing the ball from the backside. It goes incomplete across the 40, just inside the 35. Has a long of 13. Shotgun. Second down and 10. A draw. Goodson starts in, then retreats. He's going to go left. At the 35, 40, 35, 30, and now to the 26-yard uh, line. How about that? He went left, dropped back to the 45, and the then saw that hole. Here's the Late flag. flag. Yep. This is going to be some kind of a personal foul. It's at the 26 right now. Flags at the 21-yard line. It's great to see Steven out in front of uh, <laughs> of McGee, of uh, Michael Goodson. A personal foul or number 28 of the defense. The penalty's half the distance to the goal. It's first down. Josh Thompson is the player that drew the foul. Tied in on the right side. Actually on the left side over there. Long snap count. Hand off to Lane. Lane tries the middle. He pushes his way across the five to about the four. It's going to be second down and a yard at the four-yard line. Lane. It's second down. I formation. Lamantia will be the, I'm going to have to call a timeout. That's we were down to a timeout. second. Timeout. They had the wrong formation. They had a wide Their receiver on the out. wrong side. And here we go. The Ags, second down and a yard at the Warhawk four. They need the three. High formation, two tights, man in motion. There goes Lane. Lane hits. Uh, don't know what's going to be close. I don't, I don't think, think he got there, Dave. No, no, he did not. I stopped his forward progress short of the four-yard line where they need to get. Third down and a yard. Two tights. Martella spin it here on the right side, and we're going to sneak for it, and McGee will go to about the two-yard line. The quarterback sneak. Three in the backfield. They do not have that straight eye with three in the eye. That man went in motion, and they go now on a handoff to Lamontia, and he's fighting for the end zone. He got to the one. Lamontia, the fullback, got the carry. Again, he's the fullback. Jaworski laying the tail back in an eye. And instead, it's going to be Javorski, and they're not, he's not going to get it. He went to the one, and that's it. It's going to be third down and goal inside the one to Javorski Lane. Again, they have the eye, but they have a wing on that eye off to the left, and that man will go in motion. And it's play action. We're going to throw. Here's a catch, and that is Lamantia off his hands at the goal line. Tight end lineup in the backfield off to the right hip. Uh, Martellus Bennett. There it goes to Lane. Lane dives in. Touchdown, the Aggies. Lane, second of the night. Seventh of the year. Fourth and goal and a touchdown. Just made it 16 to 7. Jaworski. And 11 07 to go in the second. Jaworski showing a little bit of jump there. He jumped over the line of scrimmage. Not like Rodney Thomas. Didn't try to run it in. He jumped in. Now, 
five out of seven. He has a field goal tonight, a career long of 45. Sanders will hold. Gibis is the deep snapper. It's down, it's up. And he is perfect for the season. It's 17 to 7, the Aggie lead 10. AM kicks off. Zamansky, he's hit this one. Uh, at the goal line. They're going to return their first one tonight out to the 10 15. Hits at the 19 yard line. Will not make the 20. Now has seven for the season. Lone setback. That man got it. Dawson, little dance in the backfield. Broke out of there across the 30, out to the 34 yard line. Shotgun for Lancaster. Dawson, we jumped into the neutral zone. This is a free play. Nope, it was before the snap. So they we ruled made it contact dead. before the snap. So be five against Texas AM. We made contact. And that man will leave the field. AM right now has run 27 plays, 150 yards, 23 plays, 119 on ULM. They're putting Zachary in motion back to the right side. He pirouettes and comes back this direction. Dawson got it. He tries and he's got a first down. He'll carry about eight yards across the 45 to the 48 yard line. Running back to his left is Dawson. First down and 10 at the 48, a throw, a catch at the Aggie 45, dropped at the 44 yard line. Ball caught by Sapp, tackled by Jordan Pugh. That'll be his fifth tackle of the night, Pugh. Meeting the 42. Shotgun one more time. Lancaster is moving Dawson from the right side to the left side. Two in a slot to the open side, the left. Tight end right. Gonna run the option. Stops, tries to cut back, and the Aggies will have nothing to do with that. He'll lose back to the 46. Tackle by Freeney and also by Henry Smith. They are three of five on their third downs. They were coming into the game tonight. We'll check their percentage in a moment.